Hi folks and welcome back to the shed. I just wanted to show you, uh, give you a quick overview of my latest addition to the retro fleet. This is the de Havilland DH-53 Hummingbird um, and it was uh, commissioned in 1923 I think um, as a uh, an ultralight trainer and this one's joining my uh, Fokker DR1 which was uh, 1918 and the DH-83 de Havilland Tiger Moth 1932. So we have the triplane Fokker, the the uh, biplane Tiger Moth and the single wing uh, Hummingbird. Now this wing is the wing that I built in the previous video. Um, so it's 1.2 meter span, 200 millimeter uh, cord, a little bit of dihedral. The spars are 0.5 by 3 millimeter carbon strips, top and bottom, just CA glued into a slot. And that is plenty strong enough. That's, that's sort of my standard wing uh, spar method at the moment. I have 45 millimeter full span ailerons, which gives quite aerobatic control. Um, the fuselage is same build as the Fokker or the Tiger Moth. So have a look at the Fokker build and you'll see exactly how this is built. All I do is uh, from drawings, I sort of come up with a bit of a plan, just rough measurements really, um, and cut out the sides from Depron. Then I glue in some bulkheads to define the width and then just box in uh, top and bottom with scrap Depron. Uh, I have plywood uh, underneath the nose here and a bit of strengthening down the side because that takes a lot of beating. Plywood firewall at the front for the motor to screw onto. Um, <clears throat> in the tail I have HXT 9 gram servos, plastic gear. Interesting tail shape, I really like this. Uh, in the wings we have 9018 Metal Gear servos. Um, landing gear is just bent up aluminium, cable tied to the bottom and I have a piano wire uh, bracing here that can, can be detached. I actually uh, swap these wheels between the Tiger Moth and, and this Hummingbird because I haven't got enough wheels at the moment, I have to get some more. The turtle deck is just poster board covered with coloured tape and glued and taped on over uh, Depron formers. I have a little um, uh, drink bottle windscreen here and I have a, a little bit of a canopy here that I can open up. Hatch battery fits in there. Uh, I had to cut a little hole there so that the 2200 batteries will fit in. I have a 40 amp ESC. Uh, the motor is a Turnergy 28, uh, 2836 1100 kV. I prefer a um, Xtronic DT750, which uh, I have some on order now, so uh, they're a lot more efficient and quieter than this one. This gives plenty of performance, but I don't really need it for this plane. A uh, little hatch in here for uh, the receiver that just sits down in there. I really need a pilot for this one. I think that'll look pretty cool sitting in the cockpit. Okay, so I maidened it this morning. Really nice day. A little bit windy, but uh, let's go and see how it flew. <laughs> 